Yo, what's up? Here I am with a brand new laptop from T-Bout. It's the T-Book Air. I've not opened up the box yet, so let's use my Swiss Army knife and go ahead and do that now. Laptop, and given the fact it's called the T-Book Air, you'd also expect it to be rather slim. A bit tricky to start. there we go. Ah, and here is our laptop. Ooh. Okay, straight away I can tell, very light, and we'll be able to see the profile later, see how slim it is. Uh, let's just take it out of this wrapping and have a look. Okay. Oh, the plasticky feel is because it still has, ah, yeah, it's still got a film cover on, so let's just take that off as well. Yeah, and the top side, here we go, and the big <laughs> cartoonish looking T-Bow uh, logo lettering up at the top left there, and some quite big, well, they're quite wide but, but not too um, tall, these, these rubber feet down at the bottom, so that should still keep the profile quite slim, which you can see from that side, yeah, quite comparable to, you know, that other Air laptop, the MacBook Air. So as we open it up, we should see some other similarities. Two, okay. Let's take this one off as well. Wow, they've really um, kept it compact, because it's only got a 12 and a half inch screen that's also meant they've uh, had to keep the keyboard and this touchpad here relatively small and it takes up pretty much the whole of the space here on this top part of the laptop intel for the processor and the camera up here in the top central part now let's switch her on oh we get the t-bow logo coming up right so very quickly uh, after that logo came up, we're pretty much straight in to Windows. It's running on Windows 10. Let's see if I can turn up the brightness a little bit on this screen here. There we go. Okay, yep, it can get gets quite bright. And even from a sharp angle, you still get a decent view of the screen. Right, let's go into the settings. Let's go into the um, direct... X Diagnostics to take a closer look at some of the internal specifications. Here we go. Right, so we're in. Four gig gigabytes of RAM and there's the processor running on an Intel Celeron CPU. Internal storage, this actually has an SSD, so solid state drive, uh, which means it should be running quite quickly. Unfortunately, it only has one port. However, t is making up for that by adding in some accessories which give you more ports. So let's take a look at those now. This one runs USB Type-C to another Type-C, uh, USB 3.0. And this one here is to add extra external displays. So TVs, other big screens, that sort of thing. This is the charger. Again, USB-C running straight to the charging plug, uh, US. And another cable, USB Type-C to USB Type-C. Okay, if you'd like to get your hands on the T-Bow T-Book Air, then head over to geekbind.com. Also on geekbind.com, we now have our fifth anniversary sale, which runs to June the 18th. You can get up to 90% off selected products. So head there now, and of course, don't forget to subscribe.